Beginning tomorrow, Iowa's governor is easing restrictions on more businesses, including some in Woodbury County. Today, Governor Kim Reynolds detailing her proclamation that allows dental care to resume and campgrounds to open with non-essential business reopening statewide. Retailers are still being required to limit customers at 50% of capacity. The governor points to social distancing guidelines as a way for consumers to stay safe while doing business. Asked today if he was ready to resume shopping habits, Sioux City Mayor Bob Scott said no. Listen, it's a concern, I think, for a lot of people in this community. And I would just tell those citizens, do what I'm probably going to do. You don't have to go there right away. You know, it's, it's, I'm not going to run out and go shopping tomorrow because the stores are opening. I'm just not going to do that. And I don't know who's right or who's wrong, but with the numbers that we've had in this county and this area, it's a little alarming, quite frankly, as, as a percentage compared to the rest of the world. Scott went on to say that city offices and facilities remain closed until at least May 15th. Meanwhile, city parks and trails are open, but public playgrounds, tennis courts, skate parks and the like are still off limits. Additionally, other businesses, including salons and restaurants, remain closed in Woodbury County. As local businesses get set to reboot on Friday, Siouxland District Health and the Siouxland Chamber of Commerce are now set to hold a press conference tomorrow. It's slated for 2 o'clock in the afternoon. You'll be able to watch that event by going to our website. That's SiouxlandProud.com. It will be streamed there beginning at 2 o'clock tomorrow. Well, Governor Reynolds has said that it's ultimately up to business owners to decide if it's the right time to open their doors. But according to the Iowa Department of Health, nearly 90% of all coronavirus cases are in the 22 counties, including Woodbury, that get the okay to open for business tomorrow. Data about virus activity across the state really has continued and will continue to help us drive the decisions we make about how to contain and manage it and, be, be, and begin to gradually reopen businesses in a responsible manner. The governor has tied the increase in case numbers to the rollout of Test Iowa, where thousands of people can be tested in a single day, including here in Sioux City.